I tell a quick story. I'll try not to make it too long. I'll try and give the short version. I'll try not to fuck it up. So the Jake the Snake live Q&A. He tells a story. I'm pretty sure that every story that he told was absolute bullshit, which was disappointing because it's Jake the Snake Roberts. You'd think that, like, he could talk for five hours and only tell the truth and it'd be amazing. Mm -hmm. But instead, he had to go out there and just tell a bunch of bullshit stories. So he claims that when he was a young wrestler, just breaking in, he had to go into the locker room and just say, yes, sir, no, sir. Not ask any questions. And he said that every day he would see these guys and they would go and they would, they would reach into their bag and they would put something in their armpit and they would go into the restroom. Then they would come out of the restroom and there'd be nothing under their armpit. And he was like, every guy does this. What the fuck's... What are they doing? But he's not allowed to ask questions. So he would befriend these guys and he would always talk to his friends and basically say, I always see these guys get in their bag and they put something in their armpit and they go in the bathroom. And they come out and it's gone. What is it? Oh, I can't tell you. If I told you, I'd, th they'd fire me. So he's constantly wondering what could possibly be in this bag. So finally, one of his buddies comes up to me and he says, Jake, I'm going to tell you what is in everyone's bag. But you are not allowed to let anyone know that I told you mm. because if they find out, they're going to fire me and they may fire you. So he says, what's in the bag? It's everybody's package. And Jake goes, What? And he said, it's their package. Their package. Their enhancement, if you will. Exactly. So Jake's like, you motherfuckers. All you fuckers are st stuffing shit down your pants and going out there in front of the women, and I'm out there with nothing in my pants. Fuck you all. So he goes into the locker room the next day, and he stands up and he just says, hey, fuck you all. I know it's in everybody's bag. It's bullshit that you didn't tell me. Grabs, he gets his big fucking towel. And he goes into the bathroom and he stuffs it down his pants. He goes, not only am I going to have a package, I'm going to have the biggest fucking package in this locker room. So they have the match that evening. It's a battle royal. Everybody goes down to the ring. Jake's walking down and he's shaking his package. Checking out all the women. I gotta be looking at my giant package. He gets in the ring. And they're about to ring the bell to start the battle royal. And all the guys all of a sudden go to the ropes. And they say, Ref, check his trunks. Jake's like, no. Don't you dare. And the ref comes over, and Jake's telling him, don't you fucking dare reach into my trunks. And the ref goes, and he reaches, and he pulls out this big fucking towel out of Jake's trunks. Everybody howls! Ah, ha, ha! He goes, fucked! It's completely full of shit, bud. It's a funny story. You know what's funniest about it? Is I knew it was coming when he's telling the story. I knew the punchline as he's telling this joke. That's exactly what I expected. So for all of you out there in the locker rooms, <laughs> next time you see Marco stunt, I want you guys to all in your reach say. into your pants, <laughs> stuff something, and start walking. And nobody tell him, because I want to be the guy that tells him. All right. Where were we? <laughs> so it's Jarrett and Pritchard versus China and Deborah. Oh, yeah, we're still on Raw. <laughs> yes, we Jesus are. Jesus Christ, keep going. <laughs> it's like this is your life. <laughs> That's what I just told the Mr. Rocco story. Everybody howls! Ah, ha, ha.